what's up guys welcome back to another video I look crazy right now and I I, I get that I do look crazy but um, yeah welcome back to another vlog if you have not watched my previous vlogs um, go back and watch them but let me just give you a brief recap so number one we moved spur of the moment last minute our landlord basically let us know that he was going to be selling the home. We had literally like 30 days, literally 30 days to get out. So yeah, that was fun. Also searching for a house right now in this market is crazy. So that was fun too. Finally found a spot and although, although, although we do love it, it's very cozy. We like it. It's like half the size of our previous house so now we are paying less money which is good but I mean we needed this space but that's okay at least we have somewhere because for a minute it looked like we were gonna have like a TP or a tent like it was really bad anyway the house is still in shambles as you can see um, we just basically moved in. We have some things together and some rooms together, but the majority of the stuff is not together. So that's number one. Number two, babe got picked to go on tour, which is excellent. Uh, you guys know he's a musician, so it's great. It's money coming in. It's experience for him. He's doing what he loves. That's great. The downside is it's three weeks that we're going to be apart which sucks um because i just realized i do a lot of stuff with him you know i do a lot of stuff with him he's my friend so it's gonna kind of be lame with him being gone for three weeks now the other downside of that is as i stated we're just moving in so we're just moving in plus he's about to go away for three weeks we're trying to find stuff pack stuff get stuff together seeing what we have seeing what we need it's just been shambles now number three I decided, um, well, babe asked me like, hey, do you want to go to church with me tomorrow? Because this is last Sunday here, like I said, for three weeks. And I have not been to church since before the pandemic, before the pandemic. So I was like, yeah, I'll go. But then I started thinking like, girl, what? You'll go. You've had this bun in your hair for a year, dang near a year and a half, really. Um, so ugh, it's just all kind of stuff going on. I don't know where like any of my stuff is. I don't know where any of my clothes are. I just don't know. I don't feel like doing much to my hair as you can see. So I may just like wash it and then throw a wig on. But here's the kicker. I didn't have a wig. I threw a ton of my wigs away when we moved. So I found this one wig that I did have and the scalp just looked really, really horrible. Let me show you. The scalp looks so fake. I mean, it's all bad. But I found it and I was like, okay, let me just get creative and make like a U-part wig out of that, right? Ooh, okay, so uh, it's not even in here. So yeah, I basically cut the fake looking part, scalp part out, cut that out and made like a U-part wig. So you know, genius idea. I'm thinking, girl, you got it. You're doing good, right? Wrong. And although, uh-oh, it does look good. This is it right here. You guys can see, um, see the little, you may not be able to see it. But anyway, I made like a U-Park with it. Thought it was a great idea. So now the downside to it is I have no idea where my needle and thread are I don't know this is like my beauty room office right now and you see everything is really in shambles I thought it would be in this little box tote thing but it's not so and I had found like a couple of scrap bundles I was gonna do but I couldn't find a wig head I mean a um cap and I couldn't find the glue. So I found the glue, found the cap. And now I really don't even feel like doing that. I guess I could if I just need to. But, ooh, I wanted to just uh, do this, though. So, man, this is just, they killing me, man. So, I don't know. I don't know. Not to even mention, I got to find something to wear. 
Okay, so do I have a light in this closet? No, I guess not. Okay, so hold on. Okay, so I haven't like hung up a ton of stuff. These are like my dresses and skirts. This closet will be. And then like I showed you guys, my other stuff is going to be in another closet. But like, because I was kind of going to think this dress, I haven't actually even worn it yet. I have these new dresses that I got from Boohoo, but we are having like casual Sundays at church since it's like in the middle of the summer, it's hot, blah, blah, blah. We're having casual Sundays. So I don't want to wear that. So I thought about little like sundresses like this. I thought that would be good, but I don't know about y'all, but if I'm going to church and I'm wearing like sleeveless, I like to wear like a little jacket with it or a little like cardigan or something. And right now I have like no idea where <laughs> any of that kind of stuff is. So I don't know. I do know it's casual, so I can be as casual as I want. I thought about this sundress. It's inside out, but that's the pattern of it. thought about that one. It is super long, so I have to like knot it at the bottom and make it like look like I want it to be like that. The only problem with this one is sometimes this top part right here kind of dips down and like my boobs be out a little bit and I don't want that at church either. And it's sleeveless, so I would still have to uh, find a jacket or something. So then I was like, well, oh, sorry, kitty. Yeah, so then I was like, well, I do have, um, so I had put like all my shirts and tanks and stuff over there. <sighs> okay, y'all, sorry, I just made my bed. Well, I haven't made it. I just changed the sheets, the bottom sheet. I haven't put the top sheet on, but I, um found this skirt that I got that I still have not worn you guys see it's just like a little kind of pleated skirt almost little pleats there ties right here at the waist it looks pretty cute I think the problem with this one is is long I think maybe that's why I haven't worn it because it is a long skirt but I was thinking I can just wear this with like a white t-shirt and call it a day with like some gold accessories oh I don't know man it's like I'm running into so many issues. I just kind of want to wait till like next week, but babe won't be here. So I don't know. So I'm trying to figure out like what I need to be doing. Babe is at a gig right now too. So he's gone, but I'm trying to figure out what exactly I need to be doing. I need to find some needle and thread. I feel like if I find that at least I can get a good jump start because I can go ahead and do my hair. Yeah, I guess if push comes to shove, I could, that's not going to look right though. I was about to say I could, because when you short, you, you always think creatively. I was like, say I could like knot my little skirt at the bottom, but it's really not going to look right because it's a pleated skirt. What's up guys? Welcome back. Obviously it is the next morning. So, so yeah, so obviously it's the next morning. Um, let's talk about it. Let's talk about last night, y'all. I barely got my hair. You guys see my hair. It's barely in. I couldn't find my needle and thread. So like my sewing needle and thread. So I actually had to use a, a like a sewing needle and thread. Make that make sense. You know what I mean? Ah! <laughs> Here's one of my friends. Hold on. So yeah, I'll be right back. Hold on.